Domain based message authentication, reporting and confirmance or DMARC is an email authentication protocol that provides extra protection to your email accounts from spamming, spoofing and phishing attacks. A DMARC policy determines what happens to an email after it's checked against SPF and DKIM records. So, how does it work? DMARC establishes a standard policy on how to interpret emails coming from domains supporting SPF and DKIM. DMARC creates a link between SPF and DKIM, collects information from them, and verifies if the sending domain sources are legitimate and properly validated. The objective is twofold. Send instruction to the receiver on how to handle emails from authenticated sources and send reports that help senders and receivers improve and monitor their authentication infrastructure. To set up DMARC in Zoho Mail, follow the below steps. Log into your DNS and create a TXT record. Enter the name of the TXT record where your domain.com has to be replaced with your domain name. Enter the TXT value. The P equals none is the basic policy recommended. It's preferred to roll DMARC out in a phased manner where phase 2 is P equals quarantine and phase 3 is P equals reject. According to your preferences, you may set policy to none to accept all emails. Based on the reports generated, on the valid spoofed emails, you can set policy to quarantine to send emails that fail validation to spam. Setting policy to reject will reject all unauthorized emails actively. You'll receive reports in your email provided in the TXT record. Setting up and publishing a DMARC record for your organization helps prevent your organization business email from being compromised, protects the domain against brand impersonation attacks, and improves email deliverability. For more information about setting up DMARC, or if you have any questions, refer to our help pages.